first time using sand fleas. I got two dozen and they're alive. And this is what they look like right here. Basically it's just a little crab, a sand crab, I guess. And that looks to be like the front. That looks like his back. And I believe you hook them near the tail. So let's give that a try. All right. It's an incoming tide, so the water's going left to right. I'm gonna cast it up current a little bit and just let it drift down current. Try to cover a lot of ground. And let's get it way out there. All right, that should be good. We're just gonna let the current take it and let it drift where it needs to drift. And hopefully along the way, a fish sees it and eats it. Just throw it in the rod holder and just keep an eye on it. All right, while we're waiting for a bite, let's go explore a little bit. Basically on a huge sandbar right in front of the Atlantic Ocean. And look at this beautiful white sand beach. This sandbar wasn't always here. And the water just flowed right in from the ocean, right against those rocks. And this is where I used to catch a lot of sheep's head. But ever since the sandbar formed, it kind of blocked the water flow and the sheep's head aren't there anymore. Could possibly be a good flounder spot. I'm not sure if they will make this right turn into this little inlet. Might have to try that one day. Got a fish, guys. Got a fish. Not very big, though. But there's something on here. Oh, let me see. Oh, he got off. Damn. Good one. Decent one. Decent one. Let's hope it's not a shark or something. Let's hope it's a pompano. Come on, baby. Oh, and let's hope it doesn't get caught in my line because it's heading out to the ocean. What is this? What is this? What is that? Oh, he got off. Oh, no, he's still on. It's a big old lady fish. We'll keep that guy for sure. I'll definitely take me some ladyfish. Hell yeah. I know some of you guys are laughing about that, but if you taste the fish cakes that I make with those, you wouldn't be laughing. I got a fish on, guys. Is he on or no? Yeah, there's a fish on there. That's a lady, another lady fish. We'll take it. Whoa. Not even that big. Oh, he got off. It's pretty fun. Yeah, we got him. Another ladyfish. Let's calm down, buddy. Calm down. All right. Another ladyfish, guys. Let's try to load up on these while we can. Okay, guys. We're on. Another ladyfish. I think he's hooked pretty good. Woo, woo, yeah. Good one, good one. There he goes, hell yeah. Check that out, another good one.
Oh, this one is decent. Hasn't jumped yet, so I don't know if it's a ladyfish or what. Oh, it might be a pompano. It might be a pompano. <laughs> oh my God. Is it? No, it's a jack. Damn. Got too happy for a second there. That's a jack, right? Yep. Definitely a jack. Thought it was a pompano, man. Oh, it's not bad. I don't think it's a ladyfish. But of course, it is a ladyfish. No, it's a bluefish. He's on, he's on. Something has my sand flea. Something ate my sand flea, guys. Come on, please, Pompano. Oh, it's a ladyfish, what the freak? How's a ladyfish eating sand fleas? Gigantic ladyfish, guys. Oh, this one might be something different. This might be a pompano. Haven't seen anything jump. This is a heavy fish. Could be a giant ladyfish, who knows? What is it? What was that? What the heck is that? It's a ladyfish? A foul hook ladyfish. I believe so. Yep, exactly what it is. Damn. Good size though. Hooked them in the ass. Something just hit the other line. something touched this one. Oh, there's a fish. It's another lady. Let's go see what it is. Gotta be another lady. However, it's not jumping. This one's on dead shrimp. You know, hasn't jumped yet, guys. Could be a pompano, who knows? I haven't seen it yet. Oh, please, is this a pompano? Is this a pompano? Or another jack? Oh, it is another jack. <laughs> yep, that's a jack right there. Let's get him back. right now back on the kayak and I'm gonna do something a little different I never explored this dead-end little cove over here maybe fish comes in here during the high tide who knows it's plenty deep enough and we're just gonna throw some plastics maybe just flounder at least that's what I'm hoping for I'm gonna throw something a little different going with a little jerk shad today you know, since it's so sandy and clean I'm thinking there should be flounder out here gonna just go all the way to the end and then back and fish all along the way okay we made it back out to the inlet still casting here and there but um no fish I think the next thing we're gonna do is head out to the grass flats since it's the water's up high, I want to see if there's flounder around. All right, so we're going to head that way now. See you guys when we get over there. All right, guys, we made it across. Still super windy. Might be a little difficult to fish, but we'll give our best try. Just trying to get some flounder in the box. We'll just make our circle. Then we're going to go under the bridge. Try to use those sand fleas to catch some sheep's head, which I never tried before. So we'll also see how that goes. Another experiment. All right, we have reached the grass flats. 
see if any fish around. It's going with a paddle tail right now, made by Slayer. And all I'm gonna do is just cast up right to the grass edge and work it back slowly. Just hooked a good fish, guys. Don't know what it is. Got out on that jerk shad, though. This might be a red. Or maybe a jack, too. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, it's a red. Oh, crap. Woo. I'm using pretty light tackles. I don't want to horse it. But it definitely looks like a keeper to me. Dang, just lost it. Damn. All right, guys, we just lost that red at the very end when I was trying to net it. I probably should have waited till it was a little bit more tired, but that was a pretty good fish. Hate to lose it, but we are really going for flounder. So let's get back over there and see if there's any more fish hanging around. Decent fish on guys, decent fish on. I think it's a red, it did hit like a flounder, but it's pulling like a red. These guys are pulling good today. All right, we got them. Woo! All right. All right. We'll definitely give it a measure. 19 and a half so I think I'm gonna keep them along with this ladyfish I already have it is a flounder oh if it is it's a pretty decent one oh, it's a pretty decent one oh my god damn Another decent fish, guys. It's gotta be a red. But 
let's hope it's a monster flounder definitely pulling like a red though it's going out to open water yeah, it looks like a red to me another slot Oh, got up. Damn. What the hell is going on? Oh, got a flounder, guys. Oh. oh my god, again. That one also felt good. All right, guys, we're gonna call it quits. Not a single sheep's head was interested in the sand fleas. I get about 30 minutes. Not a single bite. Wind's getting pretty bad down here. Go ahead and head on in. We didn't accomplish our goal today with the pompanos or the whitings, but we did find a bunch of ladyfish that's gonna make some awesome fish patties. I'll try to include that at the end of the video. And after we caught those, we went into the flats, found some nice redfish and some flounder, but we couldn't land most of them. Did keep one red around 19 and a quarter, and that'll be a good dinner also. I mean, other than that, I think the weather played a huge role today. I don't think the bite was as good as it should have been. But we'll come back out here again, give it a try. Love this area, always fishy as heck. So thanks for joining me on another video. We'll get back out here real soon. So I hope to see you guys in the next one.